Hello everyone and welcome to another update with Coach B from MassyChess.com. And this is a quick video of some of the improvements I've done to the website in the last month. First of all, I was able to finish the rating adjustments for all the puzzles on the website. If you go on my website MassyChess.com and you go to the Endgame versus Computer, you'll find that the puzzles will match the correct rating now. If you click on any of the end games, you'll be able to see that this time they will be split into the appropriate ratings for those lessons. Uh, they will be split into three categories. Intermediate, which should be for players rated between 1200 to 1600. Then you'd have the advanced section, which are for players rated between 1600 to 2000. And also if you scroll down, you're going to have the expert and master section. Next, I'm still in the process of fixing all the pictures and the positions. So if you go to my website, you'll be able to track my progress. The best way to see my progress there is clicking on the beginner to master course. And I've started fixing these in order as my course progresses. So you will see everything that I highlighted in green. I was able to fix the positions to make sure that the picture matches the position that you're going to be playing and also that it is in the proper rating category so this is kind of where i'm at i'm still working in the 1200 to 1600 section i just finished the knight versus lone pawn and i'm going to continue with the rook end games uh, and going on through the end of the course if i go back to the home page you will also see that if i click the end game versus computer you'll see some of these buttons have a lighter color uh, those are the positions that I fixed uh, again following the order of the course so if I click on pawn end games uh, you will see that I was able to fix all the opposition fox and the chicken uh, and and so on so uh, let me just click on our flanking uh, you can see all of these grayed out positions uh, have been fixed but also I've gone through every single position to make sure that it is in the proper rating uh, like I've mentioned before, due to the naming of the files, a lot of pictures kind of switched and they kept changing and they've even changed sections. And I'm going through every single position. Uh, like I said, I've gone through many materials, many books, and I've just put them on here. But now I'm going through every single one to make sure that it matches the lesson and that uh, it matches the proper rating. So this is kind of where I'm at with that. Um, I'm going to continue working on this and uh, hopefully within a month or two I should be caught up with that. The third improvement that I made on the website is uh, some puzzles programming. I'm paying a programmer from Poland and he helped me design some programming for building in puzzles that will be very beneficial especially for coaches. So let me go to the website to show you what I mean. So if we go in the 300 to 800 uh, section uh, where I have the tactics. If you click on practice for these, you'll be able to see some puzzles. And the nice thing is that as you're solving these puzzles, you will be able to uh, see the progress, especially if you're a coach, you will be able to see if the students completed all of the puzzles in that section. This is a really cool future and I'm hoping to work on this and prepare pretty much the entire beginner to master endgame course to have it developed this way, especially for coaches that have students to be able to see the progress of the students for each lesson before they move on. And the last thing that we are working on now is um, improving the end games using databases and AI. A lot of the time an engine will play just like an engine. If it's a lost position, it's not going to fight as a human being to try to defend his position. It will make some moves that will just make it easier for the player to win. So we're trying to improve that with the programming tools. I already have a method with the puzzle programming where I could force the engine to follow a particular line and then continue from there. So those will be improvements that are coming in the near future. So I really appreciate you using my website. Again, don't forget to like my videos and share them, subscribe to my channel. Uh, right now I'm working on a lot of technical stuff, but as soon as I'm done fixing all those bugs and all the technical stuff, I will be able to pick up the course and continue from where I left off from the 1800 to 2000 rating. I appreciate your patience. Being a teacher, a coach, and a father of five kids, things are not moving as fast as I want to. But I am working on the website almost every day, especially in the morning at schools and whenever I have time off. So please stay tuned and share the channel with your friends and family to support the work that I'm doing. Thank you and have a great day.